Hi, it's Mrs. Martin here, and I am giving you my first book talk as promised. Woo, and there goes my light. We'll get under a straight light in a minute. As you can see, I am doing my first book talk carpool karaoke style, except instead of karaoke, I'm book talking. So, um, something just a little different for you. I have just dropped my daughter off at morning swim practice, and um, now we're going to talk a little book. And I don't have a copy of the book with me. Normally when you do your book talk, you'd have a copy of the book so you can show people what the cover looks like. I just am doing this on a whim right now because I promised I would have an example to show my class today. So, the book I'll be talking about is a book I read this summer called Belly Up by Stuart Gibb. And it is, it's a lower reading level, probably intended for more of an elementary crowd. Um, the cover of the book is green and yellow block and it's got a hippopotamus upside down, hence the name Belly Up. So the book is the first in a series about animals by Stuart Gibb. So if you were looking for it in our library, you would look under the G's. G-I-B-B -B is the author of this last name. Um, it is about a kid who his parents live in um, an amusement park slash zoo type entertainment facility. And at the beginning of the story, a hippopotamus in the zoo has died. He's gone belly up. Um, and the entire book is a mystery about how this hippopotamus died. It, the um, autopsy of the hippopotamus revealed that there was something sharp in the hippopotamus's intestines. So it wasn't just hippopotamus death, it was a hippopotamus murder. So the kid has to get to the bottom of it. I learned a lot of really cool animal facts, like zoo animal facts from the book, so I really enjoyed it. I didn't get a feeling like this book is way too young for me or I wasn't not enjoying the book because I felt it was too childish. Um, I thought it was, it moved along well. It was a good story, it was original. And I learned a lot of cool animal facts. So I gave it a three on my Goodreads account out of five stars, which is about average for me. And I think I would go on and read the next book in the series that takes place in a different zoo. So that's Belly Up, the first carpool book talk by Mrs. Morton of the year. And um, a good example of how you can do your book talk. All right, thanks for tuning in. Bye.